Hey, it's Kerry Sullivan here with another How to Kick Ass in Sales.com video, and today is all about the three things that you need to go out there and dominate in sales. Last week I did a great interview with a guy named Jarek Robbins and he talked about the three things that you need to master as a sales professional to take things to the next level and it's your thoughts, right? It's your beliefs and your emotions, right? And when you have control over all three of those things, you can become an absolute master. And one of the things I was always taught in sports psychology is it came down to three things and it's the same three things but they call it your conscious mind, your subconscious mind, and your self-image. What Jarek was talking about is really the same thing, but it's the way it's worded is a lot more clear because you talk about conscious mind, subconscious mind, it kind of gets a little hard to wrap your mind around. But your thoughts, your beliefs, and your emotions, I think everybody can relate to that. And I was able to relate to it a lot better. So I want to break this down and how you use this effectively and how you can use it effectively to really go out there and crush it in sales. So the first thing is your thoughts, right? Your thoughts control ultimately your beliefs. You know, all a belief is is a thought you keep on thinking. And we know this through neuroscience now that if you continually do something or think something, you will create a neural network in your brain and that thing will become a belief or super real to you, right? So the first thing is you got to control your thoughts on a daily basis, right? And one of the things is is that, you know, in sports psychology and with Navy SEALs or any top performer out there, they win in the mind first, right? Listen to me and feel me on that. They win in the mind first. So you got to start thinking like a champion, and being a champion, and being that all-star salesperson in the here, in the now, right? In the here, in the now. One of the ways you can do that is you can start having gratitude for being that person right here and now and getting into that feeling place of it, right? Because so much of being a great salesperson is being able to control your physiology, right? Your physiology and that feeling, right? And your emotions within you. There's a difference between thinking you can and knowing you can, right? And when you know you can, you have that internal feeling with inside of you that you know you can get it done, right? And that's where the 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 emotions and the beliefs come together, right? So your emotions then are you being in that state because you can think that you can do something, you can believe that you can do something, but if you're not in that physiological state, to get whatever it is you need to get done, it's not get, going to get done. Like you might be feeling like crap or whatever, right? And you walk into somewhere and you're like, I know I can do this. Done it a million times before. And then you're all nonchalant about it because you're not all pumped up. Look, it's not going to go good, right? Just think about sports where a guy just doesn't have that physiology, right? They're super tired. They just can't get it done, whatever it may be. Whereas a champion... A champion is going to be able to maintain that state, that focus all together. So when you put all three of those things together, your beliefs, right, your thoughts and your emotions, you're going to kill it. But if any one of those three things is off, it's going nowhere, right? It's going nowhere. So you have to master all three of those things. So as a sales professional, you got to think that yes, I am the best sales professional out there. I can go in there and I can get this done. You need to get, continually repeat that, right? And get that belief in there. So to really get that belief in there though, right? To really get that belief in there, it takes practice, right? It takes practice. When you practice executing on what it is you're going for, right? What it is that you're going for, you start to get that belief that yes, I can do it, right? But then you got to bring into it that emotion, right? That emotion, that state where you have that certainty that you can get it done and take things to the next level. And the way you can do that is by breathing, right? Holding your body in that posture in your Superman stance, right? Hands on hips, whatever, right? In that Superman stance and taking things to the next level that way, right? And breathing strongly, right? And just when you put all three of these things together, you're able to go out there and take things to the next level as a sales professional. And, you know, don't get me wrong. You need to have the skills. I'm not saying you can have these three things and go out there and just get it done. No, you got to have the skills. And again, the skill development 
right? The skill development is, 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 is ingrained in developing those beliefs, right? That's the way it goes. So do the daily practice to get that thing done and go out there and earn your excellence every single day. You got to earn it every single day, every single day. You know, it's like the Navy SEAL say the only easy day was yesterday, right? And the reason they say that is because you have to come in there and you got to earn it every single day. Every single day. It's the same thing in sports. Same thing with top business professionals. They know this and they realize it because if they don't come in there and they don't earn it every single day, someone else is going to come on and come in and knock them out of their job, off the market, whatever it may be. Things are competitive. That's just the way it goes. So anyway, use those three things. Again, it's your thoughts, your beliefs, and your emotions and you'll have ultimate power to go out there and to be able to execute in sales or really anything in life and take things to the next level. This is Kerry Sullivan with another How to Kick Ass at Sales.com video. Thank you so much for watching this and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.